will have two reactions. One is a legal reaction. The legal reaction means that we will take the procedural uh, steps to bring the, the council, to take the council to the European Court of Justice. Of course, this is a, a, a long run uh, procedure and uh, it will take like 18 months or so. Meanwhile, of course, we will have also a political uh, reaction. I'm talking uh, about the things that will be decided by the Conference of Presidents in the following days. But what I can tell you right now is, for example, that on Schengen, both on the evaluation mechanism and on the new governance uh, regarding the reintroduction of border controls in uh, exceptional circumstances, we, uh, we already voted in LIBE and adopted the two reports. We will vote them in uh, the parliament next month, which means that that will be the first reading. And unfortunately, all the negotiations that uh, my uh, colleague Carlos Coelho and myself, we have done for months and months, uh, totally open and in good faith to reach a good compromise, they, uh, they will be lost unless the council changes its mood and understand the big mistake that it has done. I was even shocked that all the time the Danish minister was talking about dialogue, dialogue, dialogue. He is still thinking in terms of pre-Lisbon. Uh, treaty, uh, uh, pre-Lisbon Treaty, European Parliament, uh, where in, in many fields there was uh, a dialogue only, where the, 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 uh, uh, where the, uh, the, uh, the European Parliament could only give an opinion. But today we are under Lisbon, and Lisbon means very clearly that the whole Schengen key is under co-decision. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. This is a personal call for the passengers. Kamara, Grafese Kowasi, Masakoe Koyo, Niyotich.